My mom has green eyes and she used to have blonde hair when she was younger. It's just it turned darker. It turned brown. Not dark brown, like lighter brown. You know what I mean? And I'm glad mine stayed blonde. We're a moly family. I've had dysplastic moles removed twice. Twice I've had dysplastic moles removed. That means precancerous. My dead aunt, we've had two, my mom had two, two of my aunts died of cancer. Um, my mom has on her back, well, first of all, last night we were paranoid. She was paranoid. She might have a tick because last time the tick on her belly looked like a mole. So I scratched. I scratched at, at the thing on her that was up here because I needed to make sure it wasn't moving, that it wasn't a mole. Well, now I think it's infected. It has a big red thing around it. Okay? She's like, why is this like this? I don't know, Mom. Maybe it got infected from me. I mean, I scratched at it, not digging into it, just a tiny bit to make sure it wasn't a mole, and piece little part came off. But I've scratched at my own moles accidentally, and you, you itch your back and scratched it. You know, it happens. It's not good, but it's happened. But that's not the point. I just looked at her back. Remember, she's 69 years old. Back's covered with moles, just like my back's covered with moles, okay? But hers are bigger, a lot of them. There's something on her back that's green and scaly. So I'm like a little concerned. None, none of her other moles look like that. It's flat and it's scaly and it's irregular and it's green. The fuck? Have you guys ever heard of a green mole? Because I haven't. I said, Mom, when you get your physical, do they check your body? for? She doesn't know. Who knows? I mean, think about it. The primary care physician is concentrating on her mental illness, on her on this, that, or whatever. And, you know, does he do a thorough examination of her body the way a dermatologist would, the way I've had dermatologists do for me? I don't know. You'd think. She's had skin tags from her armpits removed, and and it was con wasn't considered um, cosmetic or anything. She didn't have to pay. I'm like, Mom, you have insurance, just like I do now that I'm on, you know. Uh, if I had insurance, and, and, and she needs to get her ass to get those checked out. Um, even if she has to go to the fucking hospital. I do not like the looks of that thing on her back. It's huge, and it's green, and it's scaly. It looks like her other flat, giant moles on her back, but it's turned green. It's green. She's like, what do you mean it's green? I'm like, I'll take a picture of it. It's green. And the thing on the front, that's not good. It must have gotten infected from me scratching at it. And just as an aside, my hands were washed. I washed my hands. I washed my hands because I touched the tick. You know, I washed my hands with soap, hot soap, hot soapy water. I said, Mom, you got to get that your entire body checked out. When I had the dysplastic from all removed, my dermatologist I was seeing at the time, this when I was working, you know, I didn't have insurance, but I was working, um, you know, so I had money, and I, she says, you need to have your body checked once a year. The fact of the matter is, I don't look at the moles on my back any more than my mom looks at the moles on her back to see if, if anything's changed. So I have no idea if that green, scaly, big, massive, whatever, I mean, it's not, when I say big, it's, but it's big enough, if it didn't start off small, we, I don't know what it looked like before, because I don't examine my mom's back, you know, any more than I examine my own back. You can't examine your back, own back. Someone else has to do it for you. And I have no starting point since I don't examine her back, you know. I just read, though, anyone with fair skin and, and light eyes, which are blue eyes or green eyes, she has hazel eyes, okay? I have blue eyes. Um, if you live past the age of 65, you have a 50% chance of um, getting skin cancer. So there's a 50-50 chance, and she's now 69. But I don't fucking care. That thing on her back, it, it, I took a picture of it. I'm going to look at it. That does, does not look good.
see if that one thing is another. Oh, I found out the follow-up boy. The reason it's about Uma Thurman is because it's going by. It's not by the a about the actress Uma Thurman. It's about her role in the Quentin Tarantino and Kill Bill or whatever. That's why they wrote about Uma Thurman. You know, um, just letting any of you care know. My mom has this big. And I wouldn't even have known about this. It does not look good. Does not look good. I wouldn't even have known except she showed me one thing and I decided just to look at her back because she'd stripped down and you know, and like, what the fuck is that on your back? She's like, what? Oh.